uh, I would like us to be able to do a reset on a number of some of our uh, trade policies. Uh, I uh, have uh, strong concerns about finally pushing back on China. We were uh, unrealistic to expect that five, uh, 4,000 years of Chinese history uh, was that our 400 years of history would, would be uh, equal to the task. Um, it's outrageous to me that we still don't have a procurement policy with China. Uh, why are we allowing them to bid on projects in the United States when we've been denied that? Uh, pushing back, I think, is uh, not necessarily being belligerent, not having a trade war, but being real realistic and consistent, standing up for our interests. One of my current projects, um, my major priority concluding this Congress, is dealing with the de minimis provisions. Now, I didn't know what we were doing in 2015 when we lowered the threshold to $800. I mean, it seemed like uh, a reasonable effort to cut down on bureaucracy. Little did we anticipate that the Chinese would build an entire industry predicated on being able to use this de minimis loophole. We are on a track. We're going to have one billion packages come into the United States this year. Uninspected, no tariff, we know to a certainty that some of it uses forced labor. Now the latest trick, uh, and we've had 15 uh, Republican attorneys general sound the alarm about how this is being used to ship drugs in the United States, precursors for fentanyl, directly to the home of the drug dealer. Uh, these are not theoretical. This is actually happening. Again, I don't think we go on the war path, slap tariffs willy-nilly. Uh, there, I mean, there's some of these things that we should be dialing back. But um, I think we ought to use the tools that we've got. And I, 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 I tend to agree with uh, Ambassador Lighthizer uh, on some of these things um, because it, we don't want to be just playing it one-sided. And right now, I feel too often we are. Now, there are lots of common interests we don't want to unspring everything. Our economies are integrated more than we care to admit. But that doesn't mean that we, are, that we cannot push back selectively in consultation so we're not surprising them, but they know what we're doing and why we're doing it.